All right, April, what would you say are the steps on putting on the chucky suit? Um, first, you want to put on the overalls. Uh, they're big and giant overalls. And then after that, you want to put on the shoes, which go over the bottom of the overalls. And um, those are big and difficult. And then after that, you want to put your hand gloves on. Those are Chucky's hands because uh, the shirt has to go over those. And then you want to put the uh, shirt on. And that goes over the overalls and it goes over the hands. And then uh, last but not least, you want to put the head on. That's how you get in Chucky. All right, Paula, what are the three things you're not supposed to do in Chucky? Three things you're not supposed to do in check is one, do not do not sign autograph for the kids. Two, do not carry babies or kids. And three, do not talk. My name is Heather. My name is Danny. My name is Amber. My name is Kelsey. Just the flaps. The top button is like for short people, like you know, maybe below about five, six, five, five. About the top two buttons and if you're about closer to six feet, maybe six one, six two, you would use the two bottom buttons. But in my case I'm five five so I have to use the top button. Alright, and the same thing on the other side. Put it up. There we go. And you just slowly slide in your legs. Just like a pair of balls. Some, some people think that this might be kind of difficult to put on, there might be a trick to it. It's not really, it's just putting it on like anyone's normal clothes. Alright, slip it in. Alright, you put one foot through like this and make sure your foot goes through this hole right here and your heel is coming out of the back hole. Same thing with the other side, you see? First hole comes out the foot, and the back hole is the heel. Okay. Put one strap over your shoulder. All right. And the second step is to put on your shoes. You want to put on your shoes before you put on the gloves or like the head or something, because it is much more difficult to see kind of like where your foot goes to put on the shoe. And you have to make sure to stretch out the shoe like this so your foot can go in real easily. Alright, so we're going to put it on the right shoe first. Stretch it out. Get the foot going. Pretty easy. It's like putting on shoes without having to tighten them. So Chucky shoes are actually much easier than regular tennis shoes. Alright, here we go. And the third step is to put on the gloves. Alright, see? Chucky only has four fingers. So what you have to do is make sure that these two fingers, your middle finger and this finger, go through the biggest slot right here, which is Chuck's middle finger, it's his biggest finger. That's how you put it on. So you put this one on like this, and slide it through. It's like a pair of gloves, and my two fingers that I told you about are right here. Thumb, your thumb, index finger, and your pinky. Alright, I'm going to stretch it over your arm, and you put on the other one, just like the right one. Alright, there we go. Okay, fourth step. Put on the shirt. Now, there's really not much of a trick to this. You just put on the shirt, just like a regular long sleeve shirt. All right. Just like a regular old shirt. And it's very important to put on your shirt before the gloves because it can be a little bit difficult trying to get the gloves underneath the shirt. Sure. Put it over the overalls as far down as you can. Just kind of pull on the shirt. And the last, but not least, the head of Chucky. All right. You just slip it in, just like a helmet. See, there's a helmet inside. It's pretty easy. You just 
take the head, just be sure your head goes in the helmet, just kind of put it on slowly because if you do it too fast, you can cut yourself and yeah, you don't want that to happen because then you can sweat from there in this thing and cause infection, so yeah, just put it on really slowly. have long hair what it's recommended that you do is that you put it kind of in a bun because if you put on the head and uh, and your hair can come out a little kid can pull it or a little kid can question it and so that makes Chucky not look real so it's really important that you make sure that your hair is in a bun so you know, when you're walking the kids won't see the hair coming out of the back of the head. Alright, any other questions? Amber. Um, what that? are some of the things that you cannot do while you're checking? Okay, you have to be sure not to sign any autographs or talk. Because if you sign autographs, you can have one different person go and check in and sign their, like, checking. And then if there's another person that does it, then they're going to have, a, uh, like, obviously a different handwriting. So, you know, you shouldn't do that because then that can question, like, you know, like, the kids can question Chucky, you know, being real. And you, and you can't talk because Chucky technically doesn't have a voice like when you're in Chucky because you know you don't want to talk you know, have your own voice come out when you're in Chucky and the third thing is you can't hold any babies because it's really difficult to be doing stuff while you're in Chucky because it really hinders your perception of things and you can drop the baby and you don't want to. Uh, right?